Yeah, I know I don't vlog on Sundays no more, but we really chilling right now. I did a little bit of productivity look. Kinda. I'll show y'all everything else. I hung it up already. Jericho Grandma made peach cobbler. Fat. <laughs> I should have got my reaction on camera. I started screaming so loud. <laughs> But we watching um, Love is Blind, chilling on the floor. We got Pat, well, Jerk got a bigger palette than me. I just got a pillow <laughs> and a blanket. And we chilling. Jerk got hot chips. You want to say hey? <laughs> so yeah, we chilling and watching um, Love is Blind on Netflix. Jerk already saw all of it. So I'm playing catch up. But I just want to give y'all a little update. All three of us. Yeah, man, you know. <laughs> the gang, got the gang with me. <laughs> okay, y'all, bye. Gang, 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 gang. Oh, I like that. I gotta start saying it. I'm gonna do nothing like Say it again. I'm gonna say it wrong and proper. Nothing lame. Gang, like. gang, don't do nothing like. Yeah, <laughs> man, you know. I'll talk to the one. Okay, bye. Talk to y'all tomorrow. I hope Jerk. I hope Jerk will forget the rest of the peach cup. <laughs> what? What he say? He said Amber else, so he don't know about just. Which one is Amber again? The black, uh, the black girl. Hey y'all, it's all of Destiny. So since it's Monday, this may start a new vlog for the week. Let me take off my glasses. So I just finished my work for today. It's currently 2:30. I try to be done working by like three every day. With YouTube stuff. I basically sat here, uh, did my voiceover, got my content submitted. By the time you all see this, the vlog will probably already be out. It's like a product mention, so the full video isn't like dedicated. It's just like a sponsorship with Hoover. This vacuum right here. Um, so I have one more to do with them, so it's actually gonna be two. The next one is in September, I think. So I was like really excited about that. Obviously, with me moving too, it kind of like, I wouldn't even say kind of, it perfectly fit with the channel. So I was just glad about that. Um, I applied for this collab with Lowell. Lowell is like a mattress company. So I'm hoping that they approve me for that. Whether they do or don't, I won't like edit this part out of me saying that I did apply. Uh, so basically they did respond and was saying like, thank you for submitting for this campaign or whatever. Um, if you're a YouTuber and you like wonder about sponsorships and stuff, sometimes I wait just on the emails to come to me from different companies, but you can sign up for different websites as well. This is a sponsor I'm telling y'all this just like free knowledge free game i'm telling you um it's a company called aspire iq i'll put it right here you can just apply um i think that do you apply or do you just sign up yeah because you like you link your youtube channel and all of that and so they can see your analytics your previous videos your all of that little boring techie stuff so you just browse through there and like find different campaigns and if you want to apply to them or actually companies can kind of click like the like button on you like if i don't want to wait to apply to the campaign they can reach out to me too through that site so uh that's where i just submitted some information to law on there um to see if i can work with them i did already purchase my bed and everything it's coming this week on thursday so if i can work with them <laughs> it would just mean that i don't have to buy the mattress myself i am going to get my box springs and everything but obviously, if we can get the match response, y'all know that'll be good. <laughs> I'm ready, so I need my glasses so I don't get my contacts in. Um, I'm waiting. On, I'm gonna wait on the company to approve that video. Obviously, since it's sponsored, I can't just make it live for you all on my own. They have to approve it. If there's any links or anything they want me to add, they do all of that. I'm gonna put this on the bottom of here. Hold on. I just had a bowl of cereal, the trick cereal for breakfast. So this is my lunch for today now. And then I had this little. I don't know when I started drinking Starbucks, but. I had just randomly got it out of the fridge um, when I was at Walmart. It's the vanilla double shot energy one. Cause y'all know, like I've never been a Starbucks girl. But anywho, nonetheless, I'm gonna chill, give myself some downtime from working today. I'm not like completely done. Oh, that's what I was saying. I sent the pictures to Lowell because they said they want like wide, uh, they wanna see your bedroom to know if it's gonna be like wide angles and all of that kind of stuff. What I just scratch across the floor? The screw. Because they want basically like a wide angle from the bottom of the entire bottom part of the mattress because that's where their logo is. Obviously the sponsorship isn't just about just getting like a, a mattress um, <laughs> type of thing. Like the company, the company wants obviously the benefit from 
gifted like giving it to me to put on my youtube channel so i sent that i should have told them the dimensions of my bedroom if that would help or not but i'm gonna just wait and see so either way um i am going to start looking at mattresses and things like that if i don't hear back from them soon just because I'm gonna still need a mattress to sleep on, but if I can try to get it sponsored first, obviously that's what I'm gonna do. Hopefully this conversation isn't uncomfortable. I just try to be a little more transparent, a little more even just helpful to other YouTubers who may wanna know about sponsorships and things like this. Um, the conversation isn't like a braggy one, it's just more so knowledge is what I just try to give. So And catch up on some of my favorite YouTubers because I really have not had like sit down time like this in a minute. So I know I'm behind, like I gotta stalk some Instagram pages to catch up, I gotta stalk YouTube pages to catch up, I'm really behind. I don't allow myself to sit still and watch TV and things like that if I know I got like so much other stuff going on. Uh, mashed potatoes and Mom, it's, it's so first. I think I got a little bit of footage yesterday when Jarek was here. Sundays are my new off days, so I didn't really vlog that much. We were supposed to split this peach cobbler that her grandma made. I should have showed it to y'all. I just mistakenly ate all of it. And didn't even show y'all. <laughs> uh, we, were, we were gonna split it, like in half or whatever. I had already ate my half yesterday. She didn't eat her half. Uh, and we were texting like last night or this morning. We were texting this morning. She was like, I left my peach cobbler, da da da. And so, obviously I can't let it like spoil and go to waste. Five, 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 five. It's so good. I love peach cobbler. I need to learn how to make it from scratch myself. And this is some spring water that my dad got me from Arkansas. When him and my mom took like a little trip. Let me get the remotes and my phone. <sighs> I gotta show y'all where I've been sleeping in the guest bedroom because I haven't showed y'all yet. I put my furniture upstairs, so I really haven't even slept in my bedroom. I kind of like this for underneath my cabinet. Whoa. Okay, they got it locked, so I can't pull it out. Oh, this one does. But I feel, yeah, I do. I already got that. I ain't gonna get another one. I like this one too. But I want this for the half bath, but they don't have it. Cause I was gonna put like tissue and things in there. Girl, it's raggedy. Why is it doing this? Why does it sound like that? It's for the half oh, bath. So pretty. I like that one too, but I don't know if it would fit. I'll get some personals and stuff and go up in You think that. that'll fit? I can't remember now. This is, I mean, it's a hard bag, but it's still a nice size bag, huh? So, you just gonna get some good foot? That's what I was thinking I would do. Oh, yeah. Or I could go with something like this. Okay, I'm gonna guess once. 127. I got my shoes on that. She really complained about the shoes. You're on carpet too though, you gotta keep that in mind. That's a lot, 119, it was 116. She's so 50. I just ate. I just ate. 119.7. I really 116. On the regular. I just got my BBS on the booty about 25. For real? Why not? Why not? Niggas are the about It's the ponytail for me. Yeah. This is beyond over it is. You like this for y'all get fat girl? Is this giving you spot like vibes? I like it. Look at this at Burgess. I swear to God, I'm not even lying right now. Girl, not the cups. What you need with this in the guest bedroom? You got a mouthwash, oh, uh, what's called? Mouthwash cups? Yeah. This you is cute. Like, you know. But no, because this matches the toilet this thing. This is really cute. Ooh, this is. Oh, I like yeah, this. I, I will put like cotton rounds or something in there. That's pretty. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm in JCPenney now. I'm gonna see what I can find for the guest bathroom. Um, I feel like mine is kind of coming together already. Oh, these are cute. I like this. Is it glass or like, let's see. I don't know if I have enough space for it. I have like that pedestal kind, so I don't know if I would have the space for that. That's the only thing. Oh, look at this one. So for a guest bathroom, I feel like this would be perfect because it's just like how much soap would you need for guests? I'm such a dummy. I just put two different types right here. I don't know which vibe I'm going for right now either. So that's cute. 
This is too. But I don't want like a hand soap thing. This one is pretty as well. That's different. This, that, or this. Literally just be either use the restroom and come out. Wash your hands and come out. Guest, half. The pony. Wigs off, but I got the most edges. Okay guys, so I want to get more towels for the closet. I just like the look of how that looks in the linen closet. More of them stacked. I can't decide if I want to. Ooh, with the gray, that'll match the walls. I'm so particular, but things like that do matter because it's going to be, well, I don't know if it's going to be hanging in the closet or, oh, that girl that's behind the register. <laughs> Is that behind the register? It's thick too. Ooh, I love it. They have more over here. Hmm. And they have more right here. Are these different? Yeah, I got my nails done. July nails by Shauna don't play no games. My nails are growing out, but they have not lifted. So, just want to put that out there. When I get some time, I may fill them in myself. I'm going to have to message and ask her which pink she used to see if I have it at home or not. But anywho, <laughs> just want to give a shout out because all of my nails still on like a month later. Basically. But we knew that. We obviously know she don't play no games. That's why I went to her. I know y'all see me walking past the colors. That's just because I just only want the white ones. I kind of like this one. It says a quick dry too. Hmm. Home expressions. Look at me trying to read upside down. Yo, I can't pick a towel. What's the world come to? Okay, wait. Because Liz Claiborne has hers on sale. And it's the Egyptian cotton kind. Thick. I feel like it's like two of them sewn together thick. Okay, so two of these, two of the other ones. Ooh. Excuse me, sir. They're regular 26, and I'm about to get it on sale for 14. Ah! What a bag, it. What a bag. <laughs> Let me stop. Is this white? I think that's white, y'all. The camera gonna make both of them look white to y'all. Probably can tell. I think this one is the white one. Oh, duh, Destiny. Bright white. Okay, got it. Two of these. These are two different patterns. So where is the, oh, this one goes with this. Turkish bath sheet, soft and absorbent. And which one feels better to me? <laughs> Somebody come get me. Somebody come get her. She's filling all the towels. That was terrible, let me think of something else. Somebody come get her. Okay, here it is, I found it. This one matches, so I'm gonna get two of these. We wanna pay $10 for washcloths or do we just want the nice quality big ones? Let's get an opinion. Uh, no, let's ask d side cause she didn't wanna be pointing out all the classy stuff. She didn't wanna tell me about Egyptian cotton. But y'all bougie, I know y'all probably already knew. d side would you wipe your behind with a $10 cloth or would you just dry off with one? What you mean? <laughs> Let me stop you. This one is, it's, a, it's worth $10, huh? Yeah, they get plush like this. I got some plushes like this. I just don't recall paying $10 for them. These towels. You want to get these towels? Wait a minute, let me go here. Girl, look at her. Look how she walking when she got to use the bathroom. <laughs> she got to use the bathroom. <laughs> oh my God. Okay, I ain't doing nothing. Buy trash. Okay, so would you get these for once for $9.99 a piece? Or would you get the clearance pack for $3.59? You don't use a clearance towel. First off, it wasn't always a clearance towel. I'm makes looking it. at it. The thing is, is what I'm saying. When you get the washing it. It was just a joke for us. <laughs> I should make jokes that. like that's that, huh? Girl, she cheap. She wouldn't even get this towel. Shut up. Get... It's 100% cotton, just like this one is. This one is just more cotton. Yeah. Anyways, I'm stretching it. They're all just towels. Huh? What'd you say? Huh? Huh? Somebody say something? <laughs> These ain't no clipping. Huh? What? What? I was watching Naturally Sunny vlog. She was showing how she stacked her junk up. And I get it. I totally get it because why would I pay $20 for this? I'm debating this. <laughs> you know how when you're working on your laptop and it be sitting flat? I prop, yeah, I prop mine up on something usually. I'm going to check five. You think five below got this?
Let me stop because my whole vlog, I've just been comparing prices. <laughs> no. Yeah, I am a price comparer. I can't help it. It's just in me. Just because you got money don't mean you want to spend it. <laughs> That's fancy. The, like the vibe of your room. I like that. This is what I've been wanting to replace. My toothbrush. I want a new electric toothbrush. I got to go through the list of the ones y'all sent me. You sit this right there. Oh. That's fancy. So where does that point to? See, they got it right there. Oh, and it aim on the wall. This I got class. She got class if y'all didn't know. Would you get this? Oh, it's on sale. Hold on. They ain't say it was on sale. Why you ain't say so? For your laptop. Because I really think that's why my shoulder is hurting. If y'all saw the table where I was sitting editing today. My bath tray is convertible. But I don't like going back and forth between taking the bath stuff off of it. Sitting it on the bed. Destiny. Total is 132 and 83 Okay, I have a coupon. Stand the top of Thank you. So it's one fifteen eighty two. Ten oh two. It's been a good amount of hours. Uh, ow! Oh, my nail just. Mm. If you wear nails, then you know what I mean when you like bend it and it like bend down in the back that's just what happened just now just finished getting set up well no i didn't just finish getting set up but i had to come back downstairs to brush my teeth um my bedroom is downstairs look at my pretty flower love it so yeah my bedroom is downstairs we trying to get somewhere <laughs> as far as the boxes go thank goodness this is my bedroom most likely the bed is gonna go right there and my why am i closing the door i do weird things when i'm trying to multitask to talk to y'all Basically, I get settled and situated downstairs, and then it's not focusing. And then I go upstairs to sleep in the guest bedroom. I'm going to show you all everything tomorrow instead. Let's, let me get upstairs first, and then we'll talk. All right, got my phone right here and my charger. So this is the guest bedroom. It may look familiar to y'all because that's my bedding. Those are my curtains I put up in here. I gotta like adjust them and finish it and stuff. I got tired. I did it yesterday and then Jerica got here and then I went downstairs to like, you know, so that we can hang and stuff like that and I never got back to it and then I just wasn't up here doing things today so I still ain't got to it. <sighs> Catch my breath. I can't be doing this. <laughs> Girl, I can't be pulling up stairs like that. It makes no sense to me to purchase brand new furniture for my guest bedroom. Because I ain't gonna be having no guests in here all the time, every month, every week, stuff like that, right? So the guests, they gonna get my stuff. So when I get to that, I get to that. But this gonna be the guest bedroom. I'm gonna work on it slowly, cause like I said, I got my order of priorities, priority as far as furniture and stuff goes. But as far as me, Still trying to catch my breath. I just didn't want to like set the guest bedroom furniture up downstairs in my bedroom just for the sake of sleeping down there. And then I gotta let my furniture come and try to figure out how to get it up here. Basically, while people was here to help me move all of this big heavy stuff, I was like, take it upstairs. That's where it's gonna belong. So I just come up here and sleep. And then the chest is right here. But I don't know if y'all remember Lincoln's toy box since this is the guest bedroom. His toys and things are in here as well. So I just moved it so that I could watch TV um, until I get around to probably moving the chest to this side. And I just set it on Lincoln's TV. Y'all remember, I think y'all remember, I filmed it when the uh, cable guy came. And I was just like, oh, let me make sure it's working before he leaves. So we kind of just moved it over here to hook it up, all that, woo woo. Um, and I got me a bottle of water. I gotta stop putting them in the fridge. I don't like chilled water. It bothers me. You were shiny. People be so weird with their text messages. Like, uh, if I read something weird, I'm just the kind of person that just won't even bother replying to it. Like, stop sending me stupid stuff. My bed is supposed to come Thursday. Uh, I have not gotten my box spring and my mattress yet. It's just constantly focusing on the chest still. Yeah. Oh, no. My scarf. My scarf downstairs. I ain't going back down there again. Y'all got me so messed up. <laughs> Y'all got me so bone. I'm <laughs> I ain't going back down there again, love. I can't do it, love. This is what we finna do. I got two flexi rides, right? I took these out because I was on a, a video check call. 
And I was like, mm mm. Hold up. I had to let them know, yeah. I'm watching Simone Sharice or Sharice Simone. I hope I'm saying it correctly. Like a dating vlog she did where she kind of went on a couple dates or whatever. So yeah, I feel like I haven't watched YouTube in so long. Normally, I literally I always tie my hair up. It's a wrap. Good night. Hey y'all, it's all of Destiny. Don't know if I've spoken to you all today yet or not. So it's about two something I think right now. You see, I just finished listening to Sarah Jakes while I was, yeah, 2.43. Uh, Sarah Jakes, T.D. Jakes' daughter. Um, while I showered up, did my hair, all of that good stuff. And I'm getting ready now to open up and show you all all of this stuff that I hadn't showed you all yet from yesterday. Some stuff I ordered from Amazon. These are the drawer organizers. Um, I wanted to get a few more of them. This uh, houses like my undies, my bras, t-shirts, tank tops, all of that kind of stuff. Oh yay, it came, okay, is this a two pack? Girl, let me find out this is a two pack. So I ordered this for the TV, right? Because there is more than one plug in the bedroom, but when you have the TV, the cable, and the, it's something else plugged up right there. Oh, and the guest bedroom is the TV, the cable, and then the Wi-Fi, like the router box, is in that room as well too. And they're all on that same wall. I kind of want to tuck the cords a little more neat. So I ordered this. Way more plugs in right there. Only thing, because it's like so fancy, that I might get a different one for in there. Because really, I only need about three or four. So the fact that it has all of these USBs and everything. The guest bedroom doesn't really need all of these. So I'm gonna wait and see where else this may need to be plugged up at. Cause I have like my categories on my Amazon storefront. And so everything that I purchased uh, specifically for this house, let me know if y'all want me to keep doing it how it's already been done. Like all the kitchen stuff is still in the same category, home decor, organization, all of that. Because a lot of the stuff that I already had, like if y'all like, for example, the knife set or anything like that, that would be under the kitchen section already not necessarily the new house section so let me know if room by room y'all still want me to categorize it like that or if y'all just want me to make a new folder uh, for everything that we buy like over here i don't know let me know or oh, my brother has this at his house i debated if i should show you all this for safety reasons i try not to show the things that i have in the house that are for safety purposes um, because you just never know who's watching on the internet. So that's how I think sometimes. Like I try not to show things that protect me. Um, because it'll help somebody if they're watching to know what to expect if they did ever try to harm me or harm, you know, the house or something like that. I don't know if that makes sense or not. But anyway, um, I probably will stop because I don't think you should update people on the safety features that your house has. Especially not over the internet. Cause I never know who watches me. <laughs> so anywho, this kind of like goes on the uh, door or whatever. And it's like extendable. I guess that's what this is for, huh? For me to know how to use it. But anyway, you kind of stand it up like this and then you prop it up against your back door or your front door or whichever door you want a little more security with. And it keeps it from being able to be, uh, open so got one of these it was on amazon everything i'm showing you right now is from amazon so we're going to put this on the door um together basically or we'll test it on the door that way y'all won't know which door i'm really using it on again safety thing uh for me to just you know not reveal too much um so jc penny these are the towels that i got yesterday this is the liz claiborne oversized 
bath towel. It's the luxury Egyptian cotton one. I got two of these. And they were on sale. I don't know how soon my vlogs are going out. Y'all probably won't even see this close to today's day. It's like the 23rd, 24th, something like Yeah, 24th, because I got a bill due on the 25th, if I remember. Uh, so yeah, I don't know when that sale may end. I don't know if I showed y'all or not, um, because my hands were like super full when I was trying to check out, but I did have like a coupon. They had one for over 75, and then they had one for under 75, a percent off that you could get. So I got two of these really large ones. Another JCPenney bag. Yeah, the towels are regular $26. Well, with the store sale that they were currently having, I saved $11.01. And then the coupon that I had to her to scan on my phone took off an additional $3.75. So I got these towels for $11.24 compared to the $26. So that's a really good deal on that. I'm actually about to use this right now. I finished some editing this morning. Forgot that this was in here to open it up to you. The portable laptop stand. I'm that kind of person. Like, I don't know how to explain it. I wouldn't necessarily call it cheap. Maybe frugal. Don't get it twisted. I will splurge and spend when it comes to this, 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 or that. But then in other ways, it's like I'm going to be looking at the price like, what? I bet Five Below got there, or I bet Dollar Tree got there, or something like that. I don't know how to explain it. It's like that same person will go and spend X amount of dollars on like a designer bag, or like, y'all get what I mean? And then here go me looking at this, like, I don't want to spend $20 for that. Like, comment down below. I know y'all probably like that too. Comment down below and let me know, because I know I'm not the only one. I tweeted yesterday, and I was just like, I don't care how much money I got. Like, before my transaction is over, I'm going to pull my phone out and be like, I got a coupon. I look like smart to do this. I got two of the um, matching Liz Claiborne towels. They go with that. And then they have that same matching print. Ooh, not the tag. <laughs> These plain solid dresses that y'all see me wearing like this are from uh, Walmart, by the way. If y'all sleep on Walmart's clothing, maybe you should not. Just wanna put it out there. 10 bucks for this whole dress. I love stuff like this because I don't have to think about at all about the outfit. You just throw it on. Shucks, my DSLR would never. So yeah, you can kind of see the pattern on it. And it's just the bright white washcloth. So these were regular 16. I got mine for $7.49. Basically 50% off almost. These are like the extras. This is a six pack, $6. It has it right there. But they were on clearance for $3.59. So 40% off on um, that coupon. Probably took some more off too. Let me just keep going though. And then while we were standing in line, since it was kind of lengthy, Boom saw these. And she got one. I got one as well. We got matching shirts now. So Lincoln gonna be like, that's my mama shirt, but <laughs> he stay doing it. Like me and Boom have a lot of the same clothes. And I guess he think like either I like stole Boom stuff or she left it here or whatever the case may be. But yeah. So we have these matching shirts, me and Boom. This was in the men's section if y'all are looking for this. It's not in the women's section. Um, so I did get mine in a small. They had the one that just says Puma, but I felt like this one was more exclusive, kinda. Uh, and it just says International Sportswear established since 1948. Okay, that's it right here. I got something from my P.O. box. So, okay, I'm learning the lights. I'm trying to learn them. This was in my P.O. box. I have no idea what it is. So we about to find out. That's the box cutter. Come back with me come back with me it's like i finished one video take a break to do like house related things and then i pause to do like more leisure type things things that have nothing to do with either youtube or the house just me trying to you know you have to separate your time out to like have a balance in life so my editing hour pause for this but sometimes i just be stuck between i can't really pause because of how behind i currently am with my content i just I have to like stop myself because I'll finish one video and just keep going and going and going. Oh, what is this? Are y'all close enough? Because this looking fancy. Girl, who sent me this? J. Lone. I hope I'm saying it correctly. Let's see what we get. Hey, I put this on my Instagram. I hate when I kind of mess up opening things because I do want to. I be trying to save the packages so I can make it look like I just opened it on Instagram. Or if I do Instagram first and I have to redo it for YouTube. Alright, so these are the business cards. I always like to make sure I'm showing y'all's cards. I'm pretty sure that's what you all sent it for, for y'all's promo. Thing on the back. This card is different. This one has the actual website on the back. Should have did this on my DSLR. Had a there we go. Business card. And then this is the other side. 
Ow, my pinky. That nail came off last night in my sleep. What we got, what we got. Girl, it's heavy. What's this? Uh-uh, y'all can't be spoiling me. It's heavy. Girl, I should've did an Instagram reel with this. It's cute. Okay, we got the cute packaging right here. Bag. Let me stop. I hate when I try to guess and I be wrong nine times out of ten. Y'all, what I do with the? Okay, it smells like leather. Oh, oh my goodness, this is gorgeous. What? Wait, cause I saw a letter. I forgot when I started working with the business cards. This is gorgeous. My, hey Destiny, my name is Jasmine. I've been a subscriber since day one, period. I love how transparent you are with us. You're such an inspiration. Thank you for being you. We recently started a black owned luxury, period. Black owned luxury, get into it. Sorry y'all, we still got an echo here. Uh, <laughs> and I wanted to send you something for travel, your camera equipment, and personal use. Enjoy, J. Lonet. Oh my God. And I just was on the phone with my brother today telling him like, um, I was just saying to him literally since we said transparent I was saying like I can literally edit my YouTube videos from anywhere and I do not travel enough <laughs> like what oh my god come on get into this black luxury I knew I was smelling leather baby look at that period y'all ain't telling me nothing y'all ain't telling me nothing <laughs> your faith could never y'all ain't telling me nothing uh-uh. Girl, let me. Ah! <laughs> Hold on, girl. They can't even see it. Let me move that box cutter. Girl, look. Get into it. Get into with the pony. Hold on. Let me step further back. Because y'all can't see the pony. I know you want to see the pony. I know. <laughs> Get into Hello? Get into it. Look at this bag. Y'all better be trying to go and scan their um scan their car because I know y'all need an overnight bag to go to Bay House in. So you better be trying to go in style, baby, because this girl, this bag is nice. It's like heavy, like quality, but not heavy, like girl, I don't want to carry this. Like, come on, uh, black luxury. That just excited me. And we got the zipper on the back, we got the gold detailing. We got the whole the gold hardware along the bottom. Y'all know how people be like, don't sit your bag on the floor. We got gold hardware on the bottom, baby. We are good, okay? Girl, I should have did a, man, I should have did an uh, Instagram reel with this. I don't even know how I put all of this back. Shucks. It's okay, because Instagram still gonna see this bag. <laughs> wow, I love this. And we got pockets on the inside. Mess, and then I complain about how long it take me to get stuff done around here. So we got a pocket in here and another pocket right there. So I feel like I could put the camera right there, phone right there. I got my privacy zipper in the back. Privacy zipper is pretty deep. Girl, I love this. Thank you so much for this bag. I love when y'all like send me things like this, like. Not because y'all send me things, but because people don't have to be considerate of you to send you anything just because they, but just because you have a business, it's not like y'all gotta send me stuff. And the fact that you all think enough of me to like gift and send me your items, that really means a lot. So thank you. Thank you so much for this. Wow, I love this bag. Great, it's going on this play. I'm ready to work on the film room now because this, I'm supposed to go to Ikea today to look at like pack shelves and stuff. <laughs> okay y'all, so uh, it's 6.13 now. I'm getting ready to call it a day as far as like doing YouTube things go. Um, Cause I kind of need to start cleaning up a few things around here and <laughs> around here. I don't know why I said it like that. But um, I just posted a Instagram reel finally. 
um we closed i closed on august the 11th and today is the 24th and the reason that it took me so long to just do like an instagram reel um i'll link it in the description box down below it'll be like well hopefully it'll be the first link if this video is sponsored then it can't be the first link but it'll be somewhere for y'all to see it um but yeah like I, I overthink so much about how I want things to be and then having them perfect and like, oh, it's got to be like this, like that, to where days will pass and then I won't even post it at all. Um, so, yeah, I'm just sitting here now trying to reply. I put it on my personal Facebook page as well as on Instagram. I think I posted it like, let me see, how long ago did it say I posted it? I try to sit for at least 30 minutes. Like, I try not to post to my story, yeah, like you can post and then just get off. But to my actual profile, I try not to post if I don't have at least 30 minutes afterwards to just respond. Um, so, let's see. Yeah, so it says I posted it an hour ago. So I think that's pretty good for me to just have been sitting here just refreshing my page, replying to you all. And I've been going back and forth between Facebook doing the same thing. Um, majority of where y'all have been seeing me sitting is in the kitchen. Um, my vanity is upstairs in the film room, but it just be me here all day. So like, I don't be wanting to just sit upstairs and edit. I like to just kind of sit over there. But um, I said I was done working for the day, but I always find myself, I'm trying to grab the bag. I always find myself continuing to just kind of work and unpack and this and that, because I mean, you can't help but look at the boxes, they everywhere. Um, some things is hard to unpack because I don't have my furniture yet. So like that specific box, it has like dishes and things in it. The ones that used to sit on the dining room table. And it has like gold rims around the plates. So I'm thinking I'm gonna have to get rid of it anyways. Just because the table is like marble, silver, and white. Anywho, the at home store, before I put this away, I try to like show it to y'all. Cause I literally be about to just like unpack stuff not even show it and i'm like you got a whole moving vlog series to document things so you need to begin your footage anyway um i just got some of these kids hangers well it doesn't say kid yes it does the non-slip flocked kids hangers basically velvet black hangers uh for when i ordered some more clothes for lincoln to put in the guest room closet uh you get a 10 pack for 4.99 so i just got two of these i like for my nephew to just have what he needs Suppose he comes to visit and him visiting ends up to him spending the night. I want him to be ready. I want to be like, come back. You don't have anything here. Come next time. He's my nephew, so yeah. I should have things for him. Uh, the trolley, just some candies I thought I was going to eat while I was in line. And then I got some of the poop spray, uh, the poop pourri spray before you go. This is the original citrus one. I'm going to put it in the guest bathroom. So yeah. If any potential guests are watching this, if you come over and you're like, what the heck is that? <laughs> you spray this before you go, um, and nobody will know what you did in there. I mean, I won't know anyway, because it's the guest bathroom, so the chances of me going in there every day is very slim. I'm just saying no. And what else did I get? I think I showed you all everything else already. Oh, the pants hangers and all of that kind of stuff. But we'll be working on the closet again soon, so we'll get to that. Y'all wanna know what I miss working out. But I feel like by the time I unpack boxes and drag things around and go upstairs and go downstairs, maybe I am working out. But I really don't think I am. I hear something. Maybe it's just because it's nighttime. I gotta adjust to a different sound of nighttime, like environment wise. All right, made it up here to the guest room. I'm out of breath. I don't know why I thought it was a good idea to walk and sing upstairs and the Lord oh and then more things to hang it's so hard to hang things when you haven't really like established where the furniture is gonna go so nothing's hanging yet <laughs> and this is where I slept last night I think I showed you all so yeah haven't started working in here yet either <sighs> I'm tired